disconnect the AC adapter from the computer. Power on the system and continuously tap F1 to enter the BIOS. If you receive a general help window, press Enter to continue. Use the right arrow key to select the configuration menu. Use the down arrow key to highlight the power menu and press Enter. The power submenu will be displayed. Use the down arrow keys to highlight the disable built-in battery option and press Enter. Assure that Yes is highlighted and hit Enter again to power off the system. Allow your system three to five minutes to cool before you open up the cover. Insert a straightened paper clip into the release hole of the SIM card tray. Pull the tray from the slot and leave it out until servicing is complete. Loosen the seven captive screws that secure the base cover. Lift the base cover to remove it. Disconnect the battery cable from the system board. Remove three retaining screws. Lift the battery up to remove it. Disconnect the cable from the power button card. And the LCD cable from the system board. Disconnect the trackpad cable and both of the keyboard cables from the system board. Remove three retaining screws. Carefully lift the system board straight up from the keyboard bezel assembly. Remove six screws from the keyboard spacer. Raise the spacer up and away from the cables to remove. Carefully pry up the protective cover from the touchpad. Carefully pry up the Mylar tape off of the touchpad ribbon cable. Disconnect the touchpad cable by raising the locking tab up and pulling the cable out from its connection. Disconnect the fingerprint reader cable. Remove six screws near the back edge of the system. Lift the left edge of the keyboard. Then slide it to the left to free it from the bracket. Align the keyboard face down onto the keyboard bezel. Insert the upper right corner of the keyboard under the bracket. Install the six screws securing the keyboard to the keyboard bezel. Connect the touchpad cable.
and secure the locking tab. Apply the Mylar tape. Carefully apply the protective cover onto the touchpad. Connect the fingerprint reader cable to the card. Install the bracket onto the chassis. Install four retaining screws. Carefully place the system board onto the chassis. Install three retaining screws. Connect the trackpad cable. And both of the keyboard cables to the system board. Connect the LCD cable to the system board. Connect the cable to the power button card. Lower the internal battery into place using the screw holes for alignment. Install three retaining screws. Connect the battery cable to the system board. Align the base cover with the ports of the system. Tighten seven captive screws to secure the base cover to the chassis. Insert the tray into the slot until it clicks into place. Connect the AC adapter to the system. Turn on the computer to automatically enable the internal battery.